Hi everyone, Gavin here. Uh, it's late on a Wednesday evening and I've um, got a quick announcement. So I'm doing Miami Pro late April, then I'm doing Pure Elite. After Body Power in late May, I'm doing the WBFF show in London and I've just booked to go to Canada to do the Toronto World's Amateur Show uh, with the World Beauty Fitness Fashion Show. Um, I've been around aesthetics and fitness pretty much all my life and I was really into uh, fitness and more about image when I was in my teenage years and early 20s and for the last, last four or five years it's all been about lifting heavy weights and just basically just getting as big as possible really and uh, a lot, at the start of last year I was touching 17 stone and uh, last year I, I wanted to um, get a bit trimmer, get a bit fitter and I went from 17 stone down to stage 13-4 uh, at the late part of the last year. And I'll be honest, I was, it was new to me, I've never competed before and I've come to realise that it's more of a mental game as much as it is a, um, a battle with getting the nutrition right and the training elements right. Now. I've networked in this fitness game for the last 15 years. I love it, I really do. And I've been a trainer for over 12 years. And I'm quite grateful for the, the people who I've got around me in terms of the, the competitors I know. My cousin competes quite regularly. Well, I've got three cousins who compete regularly. So a big shout out to David, Eamon and Michelle. Uh, also my brother is a huge support to me as well. And I've also got some good friends who are heavily competing both in the UK and on the global stage. So for myself, it just feels right to this year uh, take it an extra bit step further and uh, yeah, just just go for it really. And um, I've just got a sponsor as well. I've never, I've never asked for a sponsor. Um, I got chatting to one of my clients and uh, he's a huge support uh, for me, so I'd like to say thank you very much to uh, Ricky Walker uh, from RSB International uh, for sponsoring uh, myself for the two WBFF shows. So uh, that's really going to help. And if you want to stay tuned, f feel free to follow my Instagram, uh, PT Gavin Townsend. I'm going to be putting most of my selfies on there because I tend to irritate a lot of people on Facebook by putting all my "Well, look at me" sort of selfie. That, that, that's that's my condition, seven weeks out to Miami Pro by the way, so it's not bad eh? I'm, I'm constantly called a, a poser, I'm kind of over it now, when you've been called a poser and about a thousand times over the years, you kind of just get used to it. Um, but one thing I have noticed since I did the last show, uh, late November, the amount of people who've suddenly just warmed to me uh, in the fitness industry as well, I find there's a heavy mutual respect between fitness competitors as they, they understand the hardships and the difficulties that you have to go through. I mean, don't get me wrong, it's not my full-time job. Um, I do on average 30 hours a week of one-to-one -one personal training. I've been DJing for the last 16 years. Um, so I DJ as well. I've also got my own shop and I sell products online and I do a few other things as well. So it's hard. It's a, my work is a, seven day a week ordeal and so is training so just to give you an idea um, my nutrition at the moment I'm having to have seven meals a day I'm doing faster cardio most mornings um, last time I was a bit too catabolic it's basically where you break down too much harder muscle tissue uh, I basically went a bit too hardcore with the uh, cardio so I put a bit of a preventative block to that by changing a few things with my diet as well as for my training as well. Uh, weight training, I'm doing six uh, hardcore workouts a week, really isolating each muscle group and yeah, get, trying to get my supplementation right as well as uh, sleep and everything else. So it's a massive balance, you, you've got to get the balance right and yeah, I'm not a pro at the moment, I aspire to be one and that's why I'm going to put every last ounce of energy in uh, this year. So, if you're going to body power this year, if you want to come by the, the gym being stand, uh, my brother and I, uh, with a few 
uh, fitness stars are going to be on that stand and we're going to be open to giving advice to anyone who's going to that show and that will be about two weeks before my WBFF show so I'd be pretty lean for that show so that's uh, that's body power mid-May coming up soon uh, make sure to come by stand K140 uh, if you want to follow me by the way on all my progress again up until uh, these shows feel free again to follow me on Instagram and Facebook have a great night guys thank you